display system also utilized by the laboratories that do uh, uh, bone marrow transplants. This specific test for this specific marker no, no, or no. HLA in general? That, that HLA or the HLA cluster <coughs> is utilized by, uh, by bone marrow transplant laboratories so they can look for donors, possible donors, type them using um, DNA typing, and then match them with somebody who is in need of a bone marrow transplant. I don't think that most tissue typing that is looking for matches for transplants is done by DNA. I, I didn't mean to specifically use that example. Um, when, I ref when I referred to bone marrow transplanting, I was referring to following the results of the transplant after it occurred and DNA RFLP analysis I know is used for that purpose because we have done some of that in our laboratory and there may be other laboratories that have done that as well. Now you said that, um, well, th that in the forensic context what, what, you've, what you've done is you've taken this existing technology and you've transferred it to the forensic application. Is that a fair statement? Yes. And would you agree that when you transfer an existing technology to a new application, there can be significant differences in its implementation? Well, sure. I'll withdraw the objection. And would you agree that sometimes the new application can be more difficult and challenging than the original application? Objection made. I'll allow I'm sure that could be the case. And that the new application may present more problems of interpretation, which may affect the reliability of the new application. It may present more problems, or it could present less problems. Now, <clears throat> I need the exhibit. I'm about to go into a new subject, which is going to take a while. Um, could we stop now? Sure. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Dr. Cotton, you can step down. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to take our recess as far as the jury is concerned uh, at this time. Please remember all of my admonitions to you. Don't discuss this case amongst yourselves. Don't form any opinions about the case. Don't conduct any deliberations till the matter has been submitted to you. Don't allow anybody, anybody to communicate with you with regard to the case. And we'll stand in recess as far as the jury is concerned until 9 o'clock tomorrow morning.